right, we're over here at the uh, my grind table, my grind area, my heavy bench. I've got a uh, 100 grain frangible 9 millimeter flat point here. Let's see if I can get that a little bit closer. Let you take a look. You see how it's got that kind of dark color to it, that sheen? Well, what that is, is from what I understand, is a pressed powder and then it's plated. Um, maybe it's not plated, maybe it's just a pressed powder with a lot of copper in it. This is a normal copper plated round here. This is actually a Berry's hollow point, 124 grain. And if you look here, this frangible is a hundred grain and the plated is lead that's plated with copper and it's 124 grain and it's actually smaller uh, hollow point aside um, these bullets are super lightweight for the length that they are because of their makeup they're not actually solid so I just wanted to hit one with a hammer and see what happens Figured that ought to be fun. Let's hit something with a hammer. It's always fun to hit something with a hammer. Here we're putting it on its side. And let's see what happens. They say if you drop these that they will crack. I'm getting a little a little scuffing there. Looks like we'll have to go to a metal hammer. This looks like a job for a metal hammer. That should be a song. Metal hammer. Da da da. Well. I'm having problems finding my metal hammer. Da, da, da. Here's a metal hammer. Da, da, da. Sorry, I gotta say it every time I say it. And it went flying. Definitely did break into a bunch of powdered chunks. It is frangible, just like what it said. Let's see. So what it took was something hard enough to crack it good. Well, here's what I got that's left over. Just powdered pieces, and that's what happens to it when it hits steel or something hard just turns to powder and I just wanted to see what happened there uh, I've seen them hit stuff but never had the opportunity to just bust one so they do shatter whereas most your plated or lead or solid or jacketed whatever they're gonna deform but for the most part stay together these frangible rounds can be real nasty you know if you even though they're made to break apart, if you were to hit a human with one, it's going to do some damage because it's going to be like a little shotgun shell in one area because it, it probably will break up just a little bit. Uh, I'd say it'd be a nasty wound. But either way, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. If there's anything you'd like to see or know about, uh, send me a message, ask me a question. Uh, Anything you want to say about how messy my shop is, whatever, say it too.